click on start icon then in the search bar type task manager click here to open it on this window click on file then select run new task on this window click on browse button now we need to select this PC then open C drive now just scroll down and open Windows folder from here we need to open this folder then just scroll down and search for cmt.exe select this and click on open after that simply check this box and click on ok it will open command prompt window so we already have a list of commands to make it easy for you and to avoid mistakes simply open google chrome then type here google.com and hit enter now in the search bar type house.tech windows commands and click here to open it now click on this link which is from www.house.tech on this window just scroll down and search for command number 12 so copy this command simply click on this right click and select copy now go back to command prompt window and right click on command prompt to paste and hit enter to execute it after that copy command number 13 go back to command prompt window right click on black area and simply paste that and hit enter to execute it once done close this command prompt window click on start icon then select device manager on this window we need to expand display adapters then right click and select update drivers check this and then in the settings open windows update now click on check for updates so it will take some time after that we need to install the latest update version then go to advanced options again scroll down now click on here and check this box then select download and install once done again right click select update drivers then select this one check this and click on next once done close this window now click on search icon and then search for cmt run as administrator now type this command sfc space slash scan now and hit enter this will take some time to complete the process so wait for it once done open graphic settings then scroll down and select video editor click on options and check this option that is high performance and save the changes then do the same for skype application uh, we can we can just change the performance settings as per our needs then go to the search bar and type your my sorry settings and then click here to open it 
now go to apps and then select apps and features and simply scroll down and then click on these three dots and simply uninstall the cross road app we need to install it again for that open Microsoft Store then in the search bar type cross error simply click here and start the installation the download process for that click on get and then simply click on play there we go finally restart the system which is very important before you do that like this video god bless